Hello, I'm Carl French from the Endless Bookcase. Many people who are specialists, experts in business and so on, uh, often ask me, well, why should I write a book? I've got lots of other things to do. And so what I'm going to try and do uh, in this brief piece is, is to answer that question. And um, it's an important question because it's true that you do have lots of pressures on your time and time and time is precious and what's the best way to spend it. So uh, there are lots of reasons to write a book but let's just go through some of them. One of the challenges in business or as an expert is making yourself stand out from the competition and the person who's written a book who is the go-to expert in that subject automatically stands out from anybody who hasn't and it has a phenomenally positive effect. So that clearly is one of the, the key reasons. People talk about differentiation, how you show you're different or better than the competition. Writing a book really helps with that. The other thing is that it's, it's not necessarily justified, but it certainly works, is the person who's written a book appears to be, and often is in fact, um, the real authority actually taking the effort to write a book often helps people clarify their ideas and consolidate their expertise so if you've written the book and it's under scrutiny then you do appear to be the leader and the specialist in your chosen area of expertise and people are convinced by that being recognized as the authority is so valuable because you then become the go-to person for those who are looking for that kind of expertise and they go to you instead of going to somebody else. A book is obviously something you, if you've written it, you'd like to sell, but actually really it's more important in some ways as a tool to promote yourself. We have many authors who give away lots and lots of their books and they say it's worth every penny. If you give somebody a brochure or some other kind of promotional material, it's very much a, a sales aid and people look at it with a degree of cynicism quite reasonably. But if you give somebody a book that you've written that is an authoritative work that covers a key subject, it has a completely different effect. It's much more positive and really does help to convince people that you are the person. It's a great promotional tool. Uh, the book also helps define what is your core area of expertise and through that you're more likely to get uh, business or work or commissions or whatever you call them from people who want that core area of expertise that you've got and uh, it helps focus what people ask for and helps you get the kind of business that you really are, have always been looking for. You get more of it. Having written a book means that you automatically improve your standing. People say, well, you know, that person has written a book. They must, they must be a specialist. They must be good. People make all sorts of assumptions. Often they're true. Uh, and then from that, it increases your standing and uh, the person with higher standing often commands the higher fees. So there's, there's these continual benefits from that. If you're working in a particular locality, the town that you live in or the place that you live, uh, you, and you're good, you, you'll probably get known in your area. But how do you extend your reach? Once you publish a book, certainly through an organisation, station like our own and, and all mainstream publishers you you suddenly get yourself in front of a global audience you're on the internet in online bookshops um, you're probably listed in other places as well and if people are looking for your area of expertise they will find your book and then they'll find you and before you know it you are in effect in front of a global audience we've had authors who've published books which they thought were principally for the UK market and then they've had sales of those books from far away places um, somebody writing on a, a UK legal subject uh, published his book and we got sales from Brazil within days don't, don't ask me why but there was somebody in Brazil who had that particular interest 
it really is a global market out there. Uh, people talk a lot about you know the money side of things and bringing in business and so on, but the personal satisfaction you can enjoy from having written a book, that sense of recognition that you get from people who are positively and genuinely impressed and like what you've done and, and recognize that achievement and your own self-recognition of your achievement. They're all wonderful things to experience and anybody who's written a book will tell you how, how wonderful that is and how positive and beneficial that whole experience is and not to be under underestimated. The other thing is, and, and this shouldn't be overstated, that once you've written a book and it's on sale, um, you will sell copies. It's hard to say how many. And that is in itself another revenue stream. I would never put that down as the first reason for writing a book. It's very uncertain how many copies will be sold. But once books sell in reasonable numbers and often sell over time, even if not in high numbers at any one point, but over over a long period of time, um, those book sales for you do become a significant revenue stream. And very nice it is too. The other thing, which again is not about money um, and not about directly about business, but is, is a great source of personal um, benefit, if you like, is being able to share what you have learned and in particular what you care about with others if you feel passionately about how something should be done or what should be done or a particular subject of interest then the ability to share that with others is phenomenally beneficial phenomenally enjoyable so there we have a number of the reasons and then by no means all the reasons why you might well want to think about writing a book and uh, there, there are things to motivate you, but the particular book you want to write will certainly focus around something that you care about. Um, so the reason why you want to write your particular book is, is, is key, and what, that will come from something you believe in, uh, something you believe is important to share with others, a message you feel is important to get out. So there we are. Uh, now do subscribe, see down there, um, and, and also in addition to subscribing, uh, do click on the bell which means you'll get notified of further pieces, uh, all of which are aimed at authors. Bye for now.